Hello friends, in this video we will solve a question that came in CSIR net December 2016 based on P31 NMR spectroscopy. The solution state P31 NMR spectrum of P3 I5 shows a doublet and a triplet. The most important point that we get from the question is that two signals are obtained with a doublet and a triplet. In option A, this phosphorus is attached to two iodine and one phosphorus. This phosphorus is attached to two iodine and two phosphorus. Therefore, it is different from this phosphorus. This phosphorus is attached to one iodine only. Therefore, all three phosphorus are different, which will give three signals and becomes the wrong option. In option D, this phosphorus is attached to 3 iodine. This phosphorus is attached to 1 iodine and this phosphorus is attached to none. Therefore, all 3 phosphorus have different environment. Therefore, it will give 3 different signals. Again, option D is also the wrong choice. In option C, there is a C2 axis and a plane of symmetry. So, these two phosphorus atoms are equivalent and will give one signal. This phosphorus will give the second signal. These phosphorus will give a doublet because of the presence of this single phosphorus. This phosphorus will give a triplet because of these two phosphorus in accordance with the n plus 1 rule. So, option C is the correct choice. I hope you like this video and leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.